Now we're told that former Monaco and Lille sporting director Lewis Campos is a candidate to take on a similar role at Newcastle. Campos is credited with identifying the signings of Kylian Mbappé, Bernardo Silva and Anthony Martial while at Monaco. The French side won the league untitled while Campos was at the club. He then took on the role at Lille in 2017 and helped them to the French title as well before leaving over the summer. Well, Steve Bruce arrived at the training ground earlier on today. He'd been due to conduct a series of interviews with TV rights holders yesterday ahead of this weekend's match with Tottenham, but they were postponed until later in the week. Uncertainty continues around his future as manager. I feel for Steve Bruce. Um, now the fans just haven't taken to him. I think, I think we know. I think we know why. Um, he is one of them. He's, he's a Geordie. He's a Newcastle fan. Um, it is sad to see, and um, you don't like speaking about other managers getting the, getting the job when Steve's still in the job. I think there should be clarity. I think they should just one way or another. You're, you're staying for the foreseeable future till we decide, or we're going to move you on now. And um, they're talking about Graham Jones being in charge for the Tottenham game. So I think there should be a little bit of clarity. But listen. Those people know better than me um, how to run a football club, um, but it's uh, it's hard not to get excited when you, you do become the richest club in the world. Well, the Premier League has been urged to meet with Amnesty International after last week's takeover by the Saudi-backed consortium. There's been widespread criticism of the deal due to Saudi Arabia's poor human rights record. Amnesty have written to Premier League Chief Executive Richard Masters requesting a meeting to discuss proposed changes to their owners and directors' tests.